Ready for ghoul school? Yes, and I think my creature name is about to appear, but I already know it's gonna say vampire. Actually, darling... Dad, that's the bus. I gotta go. I don't want to be late. Welcome to class. Today we'll be learning about the rarest type of creature. Does anyone know what it is? Isn't the rarest one a mermaid? No, dear. It's a fairy. But aren't fairies extinct? No. Legend says there's only two left in the whole world. That is why all creatures here must get a DNA check. What would happen if one of the students here was a fairy? They would be taken for experimentation, but we've never found a fairy before. <laughs> Next in line. Hmm, your facial structure is very unique. Okay, open for the DNA test. We need your DNA. Wait, I... I feel sick. You look fine. No, really, I feel like I could just ugh, throw up at any second. Okay, you can have a pass for today. But you'll have to get the DNA check tomorrow. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Thanks. Dad, you've got some explaining to do. My creature name just appeared and it says fairy. Oh, darling, I knew this day would come. So I'm not a vampire like you? Well, no, you're not. I knew it! You told me my things weren't coming in because I was a late bloomer, but I knew there was another reason. So I guess this means you're not actually my dad. No, I adopted you. Well, apparently fairies are the most rarest creature. Please tell me you didn't take the DNA test. No, I didn't. I told them that I was feeling sick, but they said I have to take it tomorrow. This is very... <gasps> what? Darling, look! <gasps> what do I do? Well, a fairies can control their wings. Try to make them disappear. Are they gone? Oh, yes, they're gone. Darling, you must control your wings at school. But I don't know if I can. You have to, or they will take you away for experimentation. There you are. It's time for the DNA check. I'm still not feeling well. You have to take it. I should really be getting to class. You can't go to class until you take the test. Hold still. We're taking a hair sample instead. Ow. See, that wasn't so bad. We'll have your results shortly. Go to class. Hey, Luna. Oh, hey, Gulia. What's the matter? You seem really sad. I'm a little bit worried about something. Oh, well, you can trust me. What's bothering you? Well, attention students, will Luna Black please come to the front office? You guys wanted to see me? We got your DNA results. We need you to come with us. What? Take her away, boys. No. You really thought you could hide from us. Let me see your arm. This won't hurt a bit. Since you're one of the last fairies, we need to do research on your blood. Uh, don't be such a baby. Doctor, I think you may have taken too much blood. Let me see. She still has a pulse. She's fine. We need the pixie dust from her blood. Time to wake up. I feel really weak. That's because all your pixie dust is now in this necklace. You'll be dead soon. What? Yes, I'm afraid we've drained all your power. And fairies can't survive without their pixie dust. I'm sorry, dear. I can't hear you. <laughs> Dad? Luna, I had a feeling they would take you. It will be okay. I'm going to get you out of here. Hey, what do you think you're doing? You are the reason there's no more fairies left in this school. Wait! Oh. Quickly, take off that necklace. Now put on this one, darling, to restore your fairy power. Luna, quickly, quickly take off that necklace. Now put on this one, darling, to restore your fairy power. Luna? No. Please work. Darling, are you alright? Yes, thank you. Of course, darling. I will always protect you. I'm sorry, I'm not your real dad. Even though we might not be related by blood, you're always gonna be my dad. Oh, darling, thank you. I love you so much, Luna. I love you too. Well, I think it's time we leave this place. I know somewhere safe we can hide away and live. Red alert! What do we do? Well, we both have wings. Oh, yeah. Let's fly. Come on, let's go. Oh, no, no, no. Buzz cut is not move. I'm off to school. What? No, I'm not choosing either. Choose. Okay, I have to pick. Oh, Mama, I'm in love with the criminal. The choices I get are so crazy. I have to choose if he writes his test or skips. Yeah, those choices are... 
very crazy. What? Are you insane? I'm not choosing. What's wrong? Choose. It's not even a choice. Choose. No. What's going on? Oh, please don't make me choose. Choose. Hey, sorry I'm late. Why hasn't class started yet? The teacher's on some kind of super serious phone call. Thanks for letting me know. I'll make sure everyone's safe. Goodbye. Class, there has been multiple zombie sightings. No one is going home tonight. That's impossible. What? No way. I want to go home. Don't you dare come here. How can you read at a time like this? I'm just trying to clear my head, that's all. The zombies are approaching the building. Stay calm, everyone. How can I be calm at a time like this? Just stay away from us. Oh no. The zombies. They're coming in the building. Get me out of here. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? The zombies are in the building. Don't panic. I'm panicking. You better hurry up. Look out the window. Some random guy is coming to the building. The bat has to be the better man. Whoa, how did you fight off all those zombies? You're so cool. Oh, you are not flirting with my desk. I mean, it wasn't a big deal. How can we repay you? How can you repay him? He caused it! Wait, how do you? Come, you and I need to talk. How do you know that I was the one who caused this? You know the random choices we get to make for our soulmate? So you chose the apocalypse? I didn't get to choose. It said either it's an apocalypse or an apocalypse. And then when I tried not to pick, it got mad at me. That is so ridiculous. Are you really thinking of kissing me right now? What? So spill it. How did you start the apocalypse? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just I'm nervous, that's all. Don't worry. We're in this together, no matter what. Kelly, please come to the stage to receive your number. That's you. Here I go. Uncover your number, please. Ten. Yes, that's my bestie. Brianna, please come to the stage to receive your number. Please uncover your number. Zero. She's useless. What a loser. Get out of here. Wow, they're pretty brutal out there, aren't they, Kelly? Kelly. Just go, I can't talk to you. Leave before someone sees us. Welcome, our class will now be divided based on our numbers. Please sit with your fellow numbers. Hello, my fellow zeros. How does it feel to be the bottom of the food chain? I don't belong here. You don't belong here? What, you think you're better than us? Yeah, I do actually. What makes you say that? Well, I'm an athlete, head cheerleader, lead of the school musical, and I'm popular. You're so popular. Go say hi to your number 10 friends over there. I will. Hey guys. Shut up, Zero. Come with me. I want to show you something. Okay. Here's a wall of all the fellow Zeros that went to our school. Take a close look. Why are they all so young? All of the other numbers, it shows them through all their stages of life. 99% of Zeros don't make it past 25. They can only handle being outcasted and having no future or purpose for so long. You mean they... Precisely. Mom? I'm home. I had the worst day. Get out of my house immediately. Happy birthday! Hope you like your gift! Gummy bears? Really, guys? They're magic! Each one gives you a different ability. Okay, let's see what the red one does. Hey, check it out! Someone left five bucks on the street. Wait, don't go over there. That car came out of nowhere. How did you know that was going to happen? I, I don't know. I just did. Excuse me, Bria. Could I see you after class? You wanted to see me, Mr. Peters? Yes, I have an assignment for you. And it's not on paper, if you know what I mean. Actually, I have to go. Mom, I think we need to report my... What is he doing? Your little brother is building a tower. With bricks? No, wait, I think he's gonna... Oh no! Our table! It's broken! What color should I choose today? Hmm, just kidding. I already picked it. Let's go with blue. 
Hey, can I go to Jessica's party this weekend? No. Jessica is a bad influence on you. Mom, she's fine. Actually, she's fine. Okay, so can I go? No, I, I just said no. Oh, come on, just let me go. Okay, sure, honey, you can go. I think I know what my ability is now. See ya. Hi, I'd like to return the shirt I bought here. Sure, do you have the receipt? I don't, I actually lost it. Oh, yeah, no receipt, no refund. Oh, but it still has the tags on it, and I have the card that I used to pay for it. Yeah, don't care, I need the receipt, okay? Your new return policy is no receipt, no problem. So let's get that refund started, shall we? Your brother wants to play. Would you just forget about me? I have work to do. Hey, Tommy, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I shouldn't have yelled at you. Wait a minute! What? Who are you? <gasps> Yesterday's ability was really weird, so let's go with purple today. Please don't be bad. <laughs> Hey, Dad, I'm gonna head to Jessica's party. Now, wait just a minute. Don't worry. Mom said I can go. I better let her have some fun before I break with the news about the divorce. Uh, you and Mom are getting a divorce? I didn't... Oh, no. You got mine reading today, didn't you? Sweetheart, you weren't supposed to find out like that. Good morning, Bria. Good morning, Mr. Peters. She's got such pretty eyes and a really cute butt. What a creep. Ew, there she is. I don't want to talk to her. Hi, bestie! Oh, don't bestie me. You are a fake friend. You know what? Take your friendship bracelet back. Ow! I'm so sorry. I did not mean to hit you in your face. Come here! <gasps> I can't believe she broke my freaking elbow. What are you looking at, Daryl? I don't care that you broke your elbow. <sighs> well, now that my elbow's finally healed, I'm going with green today. <laughs> well, what is that? Wait, can I control time? Oh, this is gonna be fun. Why are you packing a suitcase? I'm moving out, honey, remember? Yeah, the divorce. You know, this whole thing isn't right. I know you still care about mom. You just need to show her a little more. Now, before I unpause him, I'm gonna give him this to hold for mom. Perfect. Daniel, who prepared this dinner? Dad did. I did? I, I mean, uh, yeah. Oh, baby, this is really romantic. Okay, I don't need to see this. You ready for the talent show? Wait, that was today? Don't tell me you forgot. Of course not. <laughs> Taught myself how to play this in one hour, so let's hope it goes well. She's really good. Time again, again, again. Stop playing. Gummy! Playing is against the law. You're lucky no one saw you, or else you would have been killed. Catch! Let's play! We're not allowed. We'll get killed. That's only if they see us. No one's around. Okay. Catch! Catch! <laughs> Catch! Catch! Were you girls playing? No, I wasn't. It was just her throwing the ball. I wasn't playing. No, she was playing too. No, I wasn't. No, Poppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? No, Poppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? Were you playing? I wasn't playing. I was just teaching the puppy not to play. Good work, kid. I'll kill the dog. No! Brianna, we're all gonna hang out after school. Are you coming? A hangout? Are you crazy? Relax. We're all just gonna talk and study. There's gonna be no games or playing. Okay. Hey, we should all play spin the bottle. No! I thought we were just going to study. We're not allowed to play. What, are you scared? Are you a chicken? No, I just don't want to die. All right, I'll go first. I can't believe you're actually doing this. Look at that, the bottle landed on you. That is not happening. Were you playing a game? No, I wasn't. It was Brianna's idea. Beach, what's this? It's a new thing started by the government. You're given a certain amount of words a day and you must use all of them or else. Well, I only have 18 words today. That shouldn't be hard to use. Brianna, how many words do you need to use today? 
18. Wow, you're so lucky. I got 5,000 words I have to use today, so I have to talk super fast and I have to use lots and lots of words. Talk, 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 talk. I can't stop talking, can't stop talking. The day is almost done. Did you use all your words? Yes. These are my last words, too. Oh, no, 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 no. Honey, what's wrong? I got 100,000 words to use today. How can I use all those words? You'll have to try your best. Understand. I only had 55 words, now I have so many. What's wrong with your voice? I lost my voice talking so much yesterday. I won't be able to use all my words. No, no, you can do it. You can. I can hardly talk. I want to switch my words back. Hello? The government? Are you there? Keep on trying to talk. The day is not over yet. I can't. 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 Hey, how many years did I get? You, you got infinity. Yay me! No, honey, that's not good. You're going to live long after everyone you know and love is gone. Hey, Brianna, something came in the mail for you. What's the letter for? Anything interesting? It's a invitation to another funeral. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm used to it by now. Now, what is a lovely lady like you doing sitting here all by herself? I'm just waiting for the bus. How about I take you out on a date? What do you think? I don't date. I don't get attached to anyone nowadays, actually. All right, suit yourself. Have a lovely day. Wait. That mark on your neck. It's the same as mine. That mark on your neck. It's the same as mine. So now you're interested in a date. I finally have someone to keep me company for all eternity. You'll never have to be lonely again. <laughs> Who's that? Oh no, that's a local years thief. She steals people's years. She can do that? She can. She's a witch. Run! I think we lost her. We should be safe here. <laughs> Could you? He's all I had. <laughs> Wait, don't go. Take my years. I don't want to live anymore. Mom, what's on my face? Oh no, you got an X. You need to cover it and put a check mark right away or else they're going to get you. Who? Oh, thank goodness you're safe. You got a check mark. I've located an X. Please don't do this. Everyone report immediately for your symbol check. So, what happens if you have an X? Those with X's are eliminated to stop overpopulation. You're only safe if you have a check mark. Next, please. I'm next. Don't worry. You have a check mark. You'll be fine. You're good. Next. I said next. Are you crazy? What are you doing here? Why would you go online knowing you have an X? I thought maybe I wouldn't get caught. Of course you would get caught. Who are you? Do you have an X too? So, where are you taking me? This is the X's hiding spot. I made it my personal duty to protect all X's. Wow, you're pretty heroic. Excuse me, miss. May I sit here? Yes, of course you can. Why would she have an X? She's just a baby. The X's were given at random. No reason and no sympathy. Oh no, they found us. We have to leave immediately. Hey, ugly. Excuse me? Why would you say that? I'm sorry. It was for a task. I'm in the 90s now. I thought so. Good luck. I hear the last 10 tasks are impossible. Hey, girl. Hey! <laughs> did you hear what Tom did? What? No. His 95th task was to stab someone, and they ended up in the hospital severely injured. The whole school's in the 90s now. It's about to get very dangerous here. 
It's really dangerous here. Let's go somewhere private and talk. Yeah, sure. No one's around. I think we'll be safe here. Yeah. So, what did you need to talk about? I'm so sorry I have to do this. What are you doing? I have to do this. I have to kill you. I only have two tasks left. That money is mine. No! I'm so sorry. I'll call you an ambulance. I'm not going anywhere until I finish my task. Well, I've made it this far. Your total's 20 even. Babe, I'm so sorry. I don't think I have enough. Hey, it's okay. I got it. Sorry if I embarrassed you back there. No, you're fine. I understand you're going through a tough time with your job. Tomorrow when the amount in my bank account appears, it might come as a bit of a shock to you. Listen, I don't care how low that number is. I'm gonna love you just the same. Poor thing, it's time to see how little he has. What? My boyfriend is a billionaire? No, there has to be some sort of mistake. I, uh, take it you saw my account? Yeah, and you've got a lot to explain. Whose Ferrari is in our driveway? That's mine. Well, actually, it's going to be yours now. What? No, I am still mad at you. Come with me and I'll explain everything. There was a good reason for me lying. Oh yeah? Was there a good reason for you having me buy your meals for the past year? Heck, I even paid your rent one time. I know, I know. And I'll be paying you back for all of it. Why didn't you just tell me? Because every girl I've ever dated has used me for my money. I was tired of dating gold diggers and I wanted to find a girl who liked me for me. I promise, I will make it all up to you, and I'm going to start by showing you where I really live. Whoa, now hold up. You have a Chick-fil-A in your kitchen? Yep, and there's a McDonald's upstairs. <laughs> Babe, who are you, Richie Rich? Excuse me for just a moment. This is crazy. One of my stocks just went up. A lot. Yeah, actually, I can see that. Why don't you look happy? I'm worried about your safety. You can't tell anyone that you're dating a billionaire. Why can't people know I'm dating a billionaire? Because I'm now one of the youngest billionaires alive. And is that a bad thing? I know a lot of people that would die to get their hands on my money. And you think they'll come after me? I know they will. Promise me you won't tell anyone about my money. Okay, I promise, but you do owe me quite a bit of cash, so what do you say you take me on a little shopping spree? Well, I can't be seen buying you a bunch of stuff, but I can give you this. Babe, this is like 10k. You didn't owe me this much. I know. Consider it a thank you for being so kind to me. I want you to spoil yourself. Oh, hey, Lizzie. Where's your boyfriend? He's at his house. Why? Oh, nothing. I just think it's kind of sad how he never buys you anything. I mean, look at all the stuff you had to buy yourself. It must be hard to date someone poor. Actually, he's not poor. He's one of the richest people alive. What? <gasps> did you enjoy your shopping spree? Uh, yeah, sure did. Good. I also bought you this necklace. Babe, it's beautiful. Thank you. Delivery for Elizabeth? Yes, how much do I owe you? Oh, it's not you who's gonna owe me money. It's your boyfriend. Lizzie, it's 1 a.m. Why are you up? This isn't Lizzie, but if you want to see her again, you're gonna do exactly as I say. You want me to wire you one billion dollars? Yeah, do it now or she's gone. No. I'll send it. It's done. Now let me speak to her. Okay, talk. Liam, I'm so sorry. This is all my fault. I accidentally told someone that you were... It's okay. I planned for this. Remember that necklace I gave you? Yeah. It's a tracker, babe. No! Please, freeze! Thank you, Liam. I'm glad you were able to get your money back. I don't care about the money. I'm just happy you're okay. Hey, Mommy. Can I ride the bus to school with my friends? No, honey. I'll walk you. Okay. Hey, Mom. Can I go to the mall with Jessica? Her mom's taking us. You can go, but I'm driving you. Okay, yeah. That's fine. Hey, Mom. There's this school trip. Can I go? How long is the drive? About three hours. No, sorry. You can't go. Okay. Hey mom, I'm finally 16. Can I please learn how to drive? No. But both my sisters got to learn at my age. I said no. This is not fair. 
Hey girl, are you coming with us to Jackson's party tonight? I would love to, but I can't. Ugh, is this about the whole driving thing? I'll take you. I have my license. You know what? Yeah. Pick me up at seven. Her father, you went to the park Through the jungle, through the dark Girl, I've never loved one like you Boats and boats and waterfalls Alleyways and payphone calls I've been everywhere with you That's true We laugh until we think we'll die Barefoot on a summer night Nothing new will be sweeter than it with you And in the streets you're running free Like it's only you and me Jeez, you're something to see Oh, home Let me come home Home is wherever I'm with you Oh, let me come home Home is wherever I'm with you You can only say yes Yes Sweetie, does this dress make me look fat? Yes you really think that? Yes. You're such a disappointment, do you know that? Yes. Giselle, will you do today's homework for me? Yes. Really? I wasn't expecting you to say yes. Will you do the whole week's homework for me? Yes. Oh my gosh, thanks. You're the best. Yes. Class, today we're doing a pop quiz. Yes. Giselle, you seem really excited about the quiz. Yes. Should we throw in a surprise presentation too? She better say no. If she says yes, she's done. Yes. Hey babe, I think we should break up. Yes. Wait, so you want to break up too? Yes. You're cheating on me, aren't you? Yes. Please don't be my bank account. I really don't need him to see how broke I am. My hand? Wait, which one? Oh, okay, guess it's this one then. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be weird. I don't know what to wear. Okay, very funny genius, but I have class today, so no. Oh, actually, this could work. <gasps> Are you kidding me? Okay, that was pretty cute, so I guess I won't be mad at him, but he owes me a new lipstick. Does anyone know the answer to letter A? No, I don't. Yes? Um, 22? Correct. Good job. Hey, beautiful. What do you say you come with me? Don't be scared. Come on. <laughs> I just knocked somebody out. Or, I guess you did. Okay, yeah, I should probably go. Morning. I just wanted to say thank you for protecting me like that yesterday. So, I guess you can hear and see everything that I do? Well, guess I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> hey, would you stop that? Hey, Mia. Hi. I, uh, I like your dress. Oh, thanks. Can I have your snap? Yeah, sure, it's... Are you... are you good? Yeah, sorry about that. Why don't I just add you? Okay, my username is... What the... Actually, never mind. That was so embarrassing. Move! Ow! Oh, I barely even pushed... <gasps> I am so sorry. Do you know how much this outfit was? No. Quite of course you, you don't, you idiot. Did you just- No, I- Zip it. You are gonna pay for my dry cleaning. Why are you so aggressive? I'm just trying to look out for you. Well, please tone it down because you're gonna get me in trouble. On my way, we're gonna party hard tonight. I am so excited. Okay, I'll be waiting. Come on, girl, let's go. Um... <laughs> Let go of the door. I can't. Oh, I see what you're doing. No, I'm being serious. My soulmate, he's- Save it. You should have told me you didn't want to come. No, Sarah, wait. Thanks for wasting my gas. You know, I thought I asked you to tone it down. I don't need you to be acting like a 
apparent to me. This is getting really annoying. When do I get to control him? Want to switch and control your soulmate? Yes. You will control your soulmate's hand with your mind. You will now be able to see and hear everything your soulmate does. Some things will be censored for privacy reasons. Oh, that's a relief. Are you ready to switch now? Yes. She's in control of me now? Great! Just don't do anything dirty. <gasps> ah! Jeez, I was just kidding! Oh, this is so fun. Ready for the concert? I sure am. Who is she? Oh, no he doesn't. Whoa! You good? Oh, I'm fine. <laughs> Chill, this is my sister. Whoops. Damn, and I thought I was overprotective. Sorry, I guess we both kind of are. <laughs> please give me white, please give me white. Red. <laughs> I didn't even know that was an option. I don't know if red's my color. What are you wearing? My assigned color. Put on this white shirt immediately. Okay, jeez. No one can know you've been assigned red. As far as anyone knows, your color's white. Got it? Okay. OMG, bestie, you also got assigned white? Yes, we're no, a group of reds is coming. We have to go immediately. Wait, why? Just go. Don't make eye contact. Uh, okay. I don't understand what's so bad about red. Everyone come in line for your color check. Make sure you have on your proper color. We'll know if you're lying. I, I have to go. Wait, we have color check. I'm on my period. You are not going anywhere. Why do you have on white? It, it, it's my color. No, it's not. The color is blue? It's okay, you don't need to be ashamed. It's red. Oh no, I need to go. You are going to a place where all the other liars go. Get in there with all your other liar friends. So you guys all got assigned red too, huh? I'm Maria. Jake. Does anyone actually know what red means? It means we're a danger to society. My best friend got assigned white. She's terrified of me. I don't understand why she knows me. Reds are known to go after those assigned white. Their pure-hearted kindness makes them an easy target. I'm so tired. Are they going to give us anything to drink or eat? You may all come out now. If you ever lie about your color again, you will be eliminated from society. All right, red team. Let's go. I'm not going to go. I need to find my bestie. Wait. I really don't think that's a good idea. You don't know her like I do. Bestie, there you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. Oh no, stay away from me. Where are you going? Why are you running? Stop running from me. Get away from me, you psycho red. I'm not red. I'm your best friend. You don't trust me? Somebody help me. This crazy red is after me. So, did you find her? Yeah, I did. Looks like it went really well. <laughs> hey. The other Reds and I are gonna go vandalize some stuff. You wanna come? Honestly? <laughs> I've never had this much fun in my entire life. Being a Red isn't so bad after all, is it? No, it really isn't. Oh no. What was that? It's the police, run! That was insane. I've never run from the cops before. Being a Red, it's something that will happen often. I... I meant to ask you, why did you originally lie about being red? You seem so proud of it. I knew my parents would disown me if they found out, so I pretended. But now the secret's out. I can never go back. It's okay. Alright friends, what is the plan next? Look over there, a bunch of people assigned white. Let's get them. This is gonna be so much fun. Let's go. Brianna, are you coming? What? No! Stop! Leave them alone! I can't believe you guys did that. You attacked them. It's our nature. It's what we do. We're reds. It's wrong. You're one of us now, okay? You need to start acting like it. I'm nothing like you. I'll never be like any of you. Where's your red? From here on out, I have no enough color. Put on red. They're going to send you to jail. Or worse, execute you. No, I don't fit in with any of these assigned colors. Therefore, I have no color. Hello, Brianna. I'm going to need you to come with me. It's the president. Hey, leave her alone. Calm down there, fella. I would just like to speak with her. Jake, it's fine. I'll go with him. Have some tea. Thank you. I thought that we may have an issue with you. 
You see, you're the only person to show strong attributes of all three colors. We chose red because we thought it would best suit you, since you are going to be quite the danger to us. How are you enjoying your tea so far? Why do I feel so easy? Yeah, we're going to need you to sleep for a little while. Good morning, Brianna. I'd like to make a deal with you. You have two options. Either I banish you from society for all eternity. No. Or we change your assigned color to white. You can do that? Yes, but you must always fit the mold. Always kind, never dangerous. Failure to do so, you will be banished. No second chances. Hey, leave her alone, jerk. Jake? Maria? Look over there. It's a distraction. Run! Do you really want to live this way? A social reject? An embarrassment to your family? Brianna, don't listen to him. We'll tell everyone that we made a mistake. That you were always meant to be assigned white. Brianna, no! I'm sorry. It's the only option. I have to go with him. I knew it. You were always meant to be assigned white. What was it like? Hanging out with those horrifying reds? They're literally insane! Don't talk that way about my friends. You can't be friends with them. They're assigned red. It's way too dangerous. Well, I am. And they're my friends. My real friends. I need to find them. What are you doing here, traitor? Could you guys please just let me explain myself? We're listening. I was only given two options. Either I'm banished from society for all eternity, or I change my assigned color to white. You still could have came with us. We would have protected you. You're meant to be red, not white. That's the thing. I don't fit in with any of the colors. There's no color I'm meant to be. What? That's impossible. But I have an idea. She's assigned white and she's sitting with reds? Has she lost her mind? Bessie, what are you doing over there? Come here. No, they're my friends. This whole color system is ridiculous. It's about time someone did something. I get to pick whether I'm going to have a baby brother or a baby sister? Pick sister. But I want a baby brother. Are you the one delivering the baby? No. Then pick sister. Fine. She's here. Hi. Shh, no, don't cry. It's okay. Give her to me. You're holding her wrong. Hey, what are you doing? Your little sister needs toys. You're way too old for that anyways. Ready? Catch. Ow! I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hit you in the eye. <laughs> My baby, what did you do to her? It was an accident. <laughs> yeah, right. You know what? Go to your room. Your sister needs a blood transfusion. What? Yes, it's a really long story, but I told them you would donate your blood. Come on, we gotta go to the hospital now. Wait! You need to donate your blood to your little sister. Come on, we have to get to the hospital now. Wait! Okay, honey, let me see your arm. Samantha! I'm sorry, I can't do it. You know I have a fear of needles. Your little sister needs your help, ma'am. We cannot force her. Maybe you want to donate? Yeah, why don't you donate your blood? After all, she's your favorite. Okay, I'll remember this. Mommy and I are going on vacation. What about me? You're staying here. You have school. We'll only be gone for two weeks or so. Two weeks? But what about food and- You can drive, and here's money for food. Now say bye, sissy. Bye, sissy. I used up all the money mom gave me for gas for school, and- now I'm starving, and there's nothing to eat. Sorry you missed me. Leave a message after the beep. <laughs> Hi there, I'm Officer Bloom. Your neighbors have reported this house. Are your parents home, sweetheart? Why did my neighbors report my house? My report says that they heard a young female crying for over an hour. What's the matter, sweetheart? My mom, she went on vacation with my little sister, but she's not answering. Okay, how about your dad? We're not really in contact with him anymore. Listen, you're not in trouble, but would it be okay if I take a look inside your house? That's our pantry. This is all baby food. Yeah, so all that stuff is for my baby sister. Alright, but what about your food? I gotta report this then. Wait, um, is my mom gonna get in trouble? Because if that's the case, I take back what I said. She did leave me like a little bit of money for food. Relax, everything's gonna be okay. Officer, I can assure you I am not neglecting my daughter. Do you think I could have a word with her alone? Go right ahead. You called the cops on me? I'm sorry, I didn't. The neighbors did because- Shh. Do you want to take care of your baby sister by yourself? Then tell the cop what I tell you to say.
You're going to tell the cop exactly what I say. You sure you're okay? Yeah. Everything's fine. Sissy, you wanna play? Not right now, okay? <laughs> Mommy, Sissy's being mean to me. She is. <sighs> I wasn't. I was just telling her that I didn't want to play right now. Baby, go watch Coco Melon. I'm gonna talk to Samantha. Honey? What? I got in contact with your father. No, you didn't. Yes, Samantha, I did, and he has kindly offered to let you live with him. No, Mom, I don't want to go live with him. He's expecting you. Come on, we have to go. No, I haven't talked to him in a long time. I'm not going. Fine. Samantha, dinner's ready. I'm not hungry. Well, that's not what you told the cop, now is it? You said I don't feed you, so here's your food. Is it good, Samantha? Good. Mom? Yeah? I, um, I don't really feel so good. Why is Sissy sleeping? Because we're going on a road trip. Mom, where are we going? Mommy, Sissy's talking to you. Sissy needs to rest, honey. Just ignore her and watch her show. <gasps> Coco Melon! Hello? We're here. Okay, there's your daughter. Go ahead and carry her inside. Karen, she's 17. I'll just wake her up. Come on, Samantha. Hey, wake up. Let's go inside. What the hell is wrong with her? Look, she wasn't gonna come, so I... Karen, are you kidding? Mommy, who's that? He's no one, honey. Just watch your show. Actually, sweetheart, I'm your father, and you guys are coming with me. No, Daniel, we agreed. You take Samantha, and I keep Susie. Besides, you left us because you didn't want kids anymore. Well, now I'm changing my mind after seeing what you do to Samantha. No. Yes, I want my daughters back. You can have one. How about none? Because I called the police. You what? Patty cake, patty cake, patty cake, baker's men. Bake me a cake as fast as you can. Girls, I just wanted to say thank you for giving me a second chance. Yeah, you know, ever since mom has been out of the picture, I've actually really appreciated the fact that I chose to have a baby sister. I love you, sissy. I love you too. Aw, group hug. <gasps> Mommy, I got 1,000 years! Shh, don't say that so loud. Come on, we're leaving. But why? No one can ever know how many years you have. Put it to private immediately. Hey girl, why do you always keep your ears on private? I just don't see the need to share it, that's all. He probably has no years left, that's why. Jake, don't be mean. Hey mom, my years are still going up. It's almost at 3,000. Can you tell me why it's such a bad thing? Don't ever mention this to me again. Now go to your room. Everyone reveal your years immediately. Who are these guys? The legend has it that the girl who receives over thousands of years in her lifetime is the long lost princess. Everyone reveal your years. We must find the princess. They already are. Brianna's the only one who keeps her years on private. Reveal it now. <gasps> 3,000 years. Come with us. I'll be right back. Your driver should be here shortly. What are you doing here? Why didn't you tell me people were coming to the school today? Uh, I didn't know. Let's go. We're going home. But mom, I'm the princess. Come on. You are never going to leave your room ever again. Mom, no, don't leave me here. Mom. Hello there, princess. Are you a prince? I believe this is yours. A crown. It looks stunning on you. Here, take my hand. Let's get out of here. So you're the princess. Oh, we must get rid of those commoner clothes immediately. Follow me. Wow, this gown is gorgeous. Princess, your years, they're at infinite. But how is that possible? When the princess meets her soulmate, she gets infinite years. You must be my soulmate then. No, that's not possible. You have infinite years and he doesn't. The princess's soulmate should also have infinite years after meeting. It's somebody else. Who else did I meet? Princess, it must be some kind of mistake. I know you're my soulmate. Will you marry me? Of course I'll marry you. You did save me after all. Prince? Prince, where are you? I need your help picking an outfit. I'm really nervous about meeting my real mother and father. Wait, what if the princess sees us? <laughs> Don't worry about her. She's clueless. I have her wrapped around my finger. Princess, are you okay? Who are you? After all this time, you still don't know me? No. Wait. Everyone, reveal your years. We must find the princess. The princess's soulmate should also have infinite years after meeting. It's somebody else. I do remember you. 
I have to show you something. Infinite years. So you're my soulmate, and not a prince? A servant boy? I'm sorry to disappoint you. I can't marry you. I must marry a prince and become queen. Are you ready to be married, princess? Don't speak to me. This is a transaction, not love. You will now be pronounced king and queen once your new crowns are worn. Wait, I object. Happy birthday, sweetie. Thanks, mom. What'd you get me? Here. Skittles? They give you special abilities. Yeah, whatever. Magical powers. Well, I guess I could try one. I don't feel any difference. Bye, mom. I'm going to school. Wait, honey, I have some bad news. Your grandma passed away. Oh. Well, that sucks. Wait, you're not sad? No. Why should I be? Bye, mom. Oh no, that's horrible. What's horrible? Jessica got hit by a car. Oh my gosh, for real? Well, I'm sorry for her. What's wrong with you? Hey, baby. We have to break up. I hooked up with Emily. Oh. Well, that's okay. What do you mean that's okay? Was it good? Was what good? The hookup was it good? I knew you never loved me. Let me try another one. Ooh, purple, my favorite. I wonder what this is gonna do. Good morning, mom. Hey, honey. I wonder if she knows that she's adopted. Wait, I'm adopted? Yes, I'm sorry, honey. How did you find out? No, it's okay. I'm going to school. Hey, Giselle. Oh, hey, Olivia. I had so much fun hooking up with her boyfriend last night. Wait, you hooked up with Lucas? How do you know that? It's fine. I've always been taught to give my all toys to the less fortunate. Well done, Giselle. You got an A-plus on your test. Oh, thank you, Mr. Bates. She can definitely get an A-plus on me. Can I transfer out of this class? Ugh, Giselle, come on. Just go on a date with me. Tyler, you ask me every day, and every day I tell you no. Fine, I'll just watch you by your window again tonight. I have to remind myself to close my blinds. I'll try another color. Orange? Let's go see what this one does. Hey, Mom. I never loved you. I regret having you and your sister is my favorite child. I don't know why I said that. It's okay. I'm leaving for school. Well, that was freaky. Hey, Jess. I'm only friends with you because you have a hot dad. Wait, you're only friends with me because I have a hot dad? Yes, I don't like you. You're a shitty person. Good to know. Hey, psst, Giselle. What's up? Doesn't Mr. Fitz look so hot? I want to marry him and have his baby. Did you just admit to being in love with our math teacher? I don't know how much more of this I can take. Hey, babe, I've been meaning to tell you. I'm in love with your mother, we're getting married, and I'm going to be your stepfather. I'm going crazy. What's the next color? Green? So good. Let's go find out what this one does. Hey, Mom. I still can't believe you failed your math test. I wish you would just forget about that. Forget about what? My math mog? What math mog? Never mind. I'm going to school. No way. Does this power make my wishes come true? Hey, Giselle. Hey, I wish you would give me your hat. Oh my gosh, yes, take it. Thanks. Giselle, you failed your math test again. Sir, I wish you would just give me an A+. Actually, you got an A+. Hey, Jackson. Hey, Giselle. I wish you would go on a date with me tonight. Well, keep wishing, because it's not going to happen. Wait, what? Do you think I'm dumb? Which color should we try next? Let's do yellow. Pause and play. I wonder what that does. Hey, Mom. Giselle, why didn't you do the dishes last night like I told... I guess I could do the dishes quickly. I told you to. What do you mean, Mom? I did them last night. Go check. Oh, I'm sorry. I must have been confused. I'm going to school. Okay, class, get ready for a pop quiz. Pop quiz? Well, I definitely don't feel like doing that. Wait, where'd Giselle go? That's one way to get out of it. 
better be your man. Ugh, this class is so boring. Why isn't it pausing? Could you stop that? I'm trying to listen to the material. Happy birthday, sweetie. Thanks, mom. What'd you get me? Here. Skittles? They give you special abilities. Yeah, whatever. Magical powers. Well, I guess I could try one. I don't feel any difference. Bye, mom. I'm going to school. Wait, honey, I have some bad news. Your grandma passed away. Oh. Well, that sucks. Wait, you're not sad? No. Why should I be? Bye, Mom. Oh, no, that's horrible. What's horrible? Jessica got hit by a car. Oh, my gosh, for real? Well, I'm sorry for her. What's wrong with you? Hey, baby. We have to break up. I hooked up with Emily. Oh. Well, that's okay. What do you mean, that's okay? Was it good? Was what good? The hookup, was it good? I knew you never loved me. Let me try another one. Ooh, purple, my favorite. I wonder what this is gonna do. Good morning, Mom. Hey, honey. I wonder if she knows that she's adopted. Wait, I'm adopted? Yes, I'm sorry, honey. How did you find out? No, it's okay. I'm going to school. Hey, Giselle. Oh, hey, Olivia. I had so much fun hooking up with her boyfriend last night. Wait, you hooked up with Lucas? How do you know that? It's fine. I've always been taught to give my all toys to the less fortunate. Well done, Giselle. You got an A-plus on your test. Oh, thank you, Mr. Bates. She can definitely get an A-plus on me. Can I transfer out of this class? Ugh, Giselle, come on. Just go on a date with me. Tyler, you ask me every day, and every day I tell you no. Fine, I'll just watch you by your window again tonight. I have to remind myself to close my blinds. I'll try another color. Orange? Let's go see what this one does. Hey, Mom. I never loved you. I regret having you and your sister is my favorite child. I don't know why I said that. It's okay. I'm leaving for school. Well, that was freaky. Hey, Jess. I'm only friends with you because you have a hot dad. Wait, you're only friends with me because I have a hot dad? Yes, I don't like you. You're a shitty person. Good to know. Hey, psst, Giselle. I'm a gummy, gummy, gummy. Stop playing. Gummy. Playing is against the law. You're lucky no one saw you, or else you would have been killed. Catch. Let's play. We're not allowed. We'll get killed. That's only if they see us. No one's around. Okay. Catch. Catch. <laughs> Catch. Catch. Were you girls playing? No, I wasn't. It was just her throwing the ball. I wasn't playing. No, she was playing too. No, I wasn't. No, puppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? No, puppy, you're not allowed to play. No playing. Why do you have a ball? Were you playing? I wasn't playing. I was just teaching the puppy not to play. Good work, kid. I'll kill the dog. No! Brianna, we're all gonna hang out after school. Are you coming? A hangout? Are you crazy? Relax. We're all just gonna talk and study. There's gonna be no games or playing. Okay. Hey, we should all play spin the bottle. No! I thought we were just going to study. We're not allowed to play. What are you, scared? Are you a chicken? No, I just don't want to die. All right, I'll go first. I can't believe you're actually doing this. Look at that, the bottle landed on you. That is not happening. Were you playing a game? No, I wasn't, it was Brianna's idea. Beach. What's this? It's a new thing started by the government. You're given a certain amount of words a day, and you must use all of them, or else. Well, I only have 18 words today. That shouldn't be hard to use. Brianna, how many words do you need to use today? 18. Wow, you're so lucky. I got 5,000 words I have to use today, so I have to talk super fast, and I have to use lots and lots of words. Talk, 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 talk. I can't stop talking, can't stop talking. The day's almost done. Did you use all your words? Yes. These are my last words, too. 
Oh, no, 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 no. Honey, what's wrong? I got 100,000 words to use today. How can I use all those words? You'll have to try your best. Understand. I only had 55 words, now I have so many. What's wrong with your voice? I lost my voice talking so much yesterday. I won't be able to use all my words. No, no, you can do it. You can. I can hardly talk. I want to switch my words back. Hello? The government? Are you there? God? Let's see. Keep on trying to talk. The day is not over yet. I... I can't. Betsy, I'm so sorry. I love you. It's okay. It's not your fault. I heard from your best friend's mom she passed away. She couldn't use all her words. Are you okay? Yeah. I'll be okay. Ooh. Please give me white. Please give me white. Red. <laughs> I didn't even know that was an option. I don't know if red's my color. What are you wearing? My assigned color. Put on this white shirt immediately. Okay, jeez. No one can know you've been assigned red. As far as anyone knows, your color's white. Got it? What? Okay. OMG, bestie, you also got assigned white? Yes, we're twins. Oh no, a group of reds is coming. We have to go immediately. Wait, why? Just go. Don't make eye contact. Uh, okay. I don't understand what's so bad about red. Everyone come in line for your color check. Make sure you have on your proper color. We'll know if you're lying. I I have to go. Wait, we have color check. I'm on my period. You are not going anywhere. Why do you have on white? It, it, it's my color. No, it's not. Your color is blue? It's okay, you don't need to be ashamed. It's red. Oh no, I need to go. You are going to a place where all the other liars go. No. Get in there with all your other liar friends. So you guys all got a sign red too, huh? I'm Maria. Jake. Does anyone actually know what red means? It means we're a danger to society. My best friend got assigned white. She's terrified of me. I don't understand why she knows me. Reds are known to go after those assigned white. Their pure-hearted kindness makes them an easy target. I'm so tired. Are they gonna give us anything to drink or eat? You may all come out now. If you ever lie about your color again, you will be eliminated from society. All right, red team, let's go. I'm not gonna go. I need to find my bestie. Wait, I really don't think that's a good idea. You don't know her like I do. Bestie, there you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. Oh no, stay away from me. Where are you going? Why are you running? Stop running from me. Get away from me, you psycho red. I'm not red. I'm your best friend. You don't trust me? Somebody help me. This crazy red is after me. So, did you find her? Yeah, I did. Looks like it went really well. <laughs> hey, the other Reds and I are gonna go vandalize some stuff. You wanna come? Honestly? <laughs> I've never had this much fun in my entire life. Being a Red isn't so bad after all, is it? No, it really isn't. Oh no. What was that? It's the police! Run! That was insane. I have never run from the cops before. Being a red, it's something that will happen often. I meant to ask you, why did you originally lie about being red? You seem so proud of it. I knew my parents would disown me if they found out, so I pretended. But now the secret's out. I can never go back. Okay. All right, friends, what is the plan next? Look over there. A bunch of people assigned white. Let's get them. This is going to be so much fun. Let's go. Brianna, are you coming? What? No. Stop. Leave them alone. I can't believe you guys did that. You attacked them. It's our nature. It's what we do. We're reds. It's wrong. You're one of us now, okay? You need to start acting like it. I'm nothing like you. I'll never be like any of you. Where's your red? From here on out, I have no assigned color. Put on red, they're gonna send you to jail! Or worse, execute you! No, I don't fit in with any of these assigned colors, therefore I have no color. Hello, Brianna. I'm gonna need you to come with me. It's the president! Hey, leave her alone. Calm down there, fella. I would just like to speak with her. Jake, it's fine. I'll go with him. 
Have some tea. Thank you. I thought that we may have an issue with you. You see, you're the only person to show strong attributes of all three colors. We chose red because we thought it would best suit you, since you are going to be quite the danger to us. How are you enjoying your tea so far? Why do I feel so dizzy? Yeah, we're going to need you to sleep for a little while. Where am I? Good morning, Brianna. I'd like to make a deal with you. You have two options. Either I banish you from society for all eternity. No. Or we change your assigned color to white. You can do that? Yes, but you must always fit the mold. Always kind, never dangerous. Failure to do so, you will be banished. No second chances. Hey, leave her alone, jerk. Jake? Maria? Look over there. It's a distraction. Run! Do you really want to live this way? A social reject? An embarrassment to your family? Brianna, don't listen to him. We'll tell everyone that we made a mistake, that you were always meant to be assigned white. Brianna, no! I'm sorry. It's the only option. I have to go with him. I knew it. You were always meant to be assigned white. What was it like, hanging out with those horrifying reds? They're literally insane! Don't talk that way about my friends! You can't be friends with them. They're assigned red. It's way too dangerous. Well, I am, and they're my friends. My real friends. I need to find them. What are you doing here, traitor? Would you guys please just let me explain myself? We're listening. I was only given two options. Either I'm banished from society for all eternity, or I change my assigned color to white. You still could have came with us. We would have protected you. You're meant to be red, not white. That's the thing. I don't fit in with any of the colors. There's no color I'm meant to be. What? That's impossible. But I have an idea. She's assigned white and she's sitting with reds? Has she lost her mind? Psst, Bessie, what are you doing over there? Come here. No, they're my friends. This whole color system is ridiculous. And it's about time somebody did something about it.